Hello everyone, this is your Sunday evening KRQE.com webcast. We begin with meteorologist Travis Christie. And we still got a winter storm to contend with. It's mainly going to be south of 40 and especially in the southern third of the state. We're talking the Sacramento's back towards the Gila and then as we head into tomorrow and into Tuesday could transition to the southeast. Right now mainly heavy rains around Las Cruces but once you get the higher elevated areas it is turning over to snow and we've had reports in Silver City of about an inch of snow and then once you hit the cloud crop area back up to Ski Apache, we're seeing snow there as well. So gradually those snow lines will drop. In the metro areas, though, it's more or less going to stay quiet. Maybe a spotty shower, wouldn't count on it, though. Temperatures in the mid to upper 40s and then quiet Tuesday onward. Travis, an officer involved shooting has two suspects in the hospital. Albuquerque police were called to the Warren Coronado apartments on the 6200 block of Indian School Northeast at about 9:30 last night after reports of a loud altercation there. When officers arrived, police say one man confronted them with a sledgehammer and another man confronted them with a knife. Police responded by firing their weapons. One of the suspects is now in critical condition. Police described the other suspect's condition as stable. Albuquerque police say alcohol may have played a factor in a crash, a fatal car crash last night in southwest Albuquerque. Police say two vehicles were headed north on 98th Street near Sunset Gardens when they made contact and the drivers lost control. One driver crashed into a wall. The other driver, 23-year-old Jesus Duran, was killed after his vehicle rolled and landed on top of him. Several bottles of beer were found inside Duran's vehicle. Police say an autopsy will determine if he was drunk. Stay with KRQE for more news and weather updates. I'm Tim Maestas. Thanks for logging on.